everybody welcome back let me move this up just a little bit so you can see now we are going to do the boys well the new babies car seat and I am not sure because I have two so and I can't get them both up there so we will try okay since he is a preemie we have two car seats. Okay, we have this one that's actually for preemie, and we have our regular car seat. Now, depending on how big he comes out as, I mean, I got him stuffed and everything, but I, because of my glass beads are here now, I may change his, his body a little bit. So depending on how he looks, I think this is set up for Oh, it might be set up for Tegan. I don't know. Because he's going to be the same size as Tegan. So I have this preemie one that the hospital gave me for Ariel when Ariel was coming home. And because she was so little, she couldn't safely be in this. She had to be laid down. So this goes up. Let me see. This goes up against your seat. This part. And this part faces the driver's, you know, the two passenger and driver seat. This goes, this does. This faces against the rear of the vehicle. And the car seat buckle, and I'll show you on this, it goes around. And let me tell you what, it is hard to do. It takes two people to do, um, cause you gotta hold it out because it, it locks. So I am quite not sure which way I'm going to do this. But this is the one that I have. I have the preemie one, the little tiny preemie one, and then I have this one that I use for the bigger babies, boys. And this is adjusted for Tanner, but I can make it smaller. It's, it's adjustable. So, and I have a black thing in here. Now I have in my stroller, in my carriage, I have a gray, um, let me go get it because it's not, I thought I had two of them. I have, um, I set up in the stroller, it's all buckled in. Um, well, let me wheel the stroller in here. and everything and let me move this swing I just need to move it over just a little bit and move my seat my little chair okay and I will show you the carriage because that has not changed and because I keep it set up for the girl and the boy okay so, as you can see, hopefully you can see, let me, um, there. See, I have this right here. This unbuckles, so if I, if I need to and I want to use the preemie one, I can put this in there. Or I can put this in the other car seat. And I thought I had two of these gray ones, so it would go to either or. I think in the girls' car seat, I have this. Let me take a quick peek. Um, yeah, that one is that one is set up for the girls. It's pink, and I have this behind it. But I think I was using this one to fill up because of Grayson. And he needed to fill it in. But I can take this out and put it in either one of the, any one of these car seats for him. So I'm not really going to know for sure until he's finished. 
to see how he's going to be set up. But here's the teddy bear. I've got two sets of these. I have another, well, the other set is just like a, it's just brown. But you can't put those, well, you might be able to on here. But I don't know how it, I don't think it would be sufficient for him. So those are the car seats. And it tells you here, the feet go this way and the head is up here. And it's still hard to believe she's standing next to me. She's almost as tall as me now. And I'm not going to show you. <laughs> and she barely, she is was teeny tiny in this thing. So it's hard to believe how big she is now to how little she was when she was, when we were bringing her home, you know. So it's really, it's amazing how big she got. I mean, she was no bigger than a CD case. I mean, she was she was little. She was little. She was probably the size of um, Tegan. She was probably the size of Tegan when we brought her home. She was teeny tiny, but it was fun. So these are the two car seats I can go with if I decide, depending on how he looks when I get him all finished and stuff. And this is... The blanket that I'll use because it is cold out so yeah so there are the boys car seats so I that is not much I mean you put your little sound machine on here you can't do that to this one you would have to put it like next to him on the seat or something and then I think it would be fun to use this one because you can bundle them up it looks so cute so after he's finished I'll do another video on getting ready to go and we will see what it looks like both ways so i'll do another video when he's finished so that is about it guys that's what my plan is for the car seat so i don't know if he'll go into this one or if he'll go into this one but we'll do a video when he's finished and here and all that and we'll do another video and getting him in there and getting ready to go for a ride so Alrighty, any questions, comment down below. Come say hi. New subscribers, come say hi. Um, go check out the 1300 subscriber giveaway. And yeah, we'll see you all again soon. Bye now.